How are you? I'm fine, sir. How are you? I'm also fine. I think I had taken your counseling also, I think, Dadar, na? Yeah, yeah, that's a good thing. So, uh, you were, uh, you are from Saint Xavier, Yes, sir. right? Yeah. And you, uh, you were getting a placement also, something like that. Yes, sir. Even I was here for placement. So, you got the placement from the college? Sir, I got the placement, uh, but uh, I'm not sure about it. Like, we are still, because I have finished my all uh, uh, interview rounds and all. It's about like uh, waiting for the offer letter. Since when you are waiting? Sir, actually, I don't know, but maybe in the month of May or June. Okay, they will be releasing. Okay. But you are sure that you got selected or what? So that is, uh, we don't know actually. Okay, because for it's example, like a... if you will get selected, then you will work or you will go for your NCA program? So it depends on uh, if I get uh, into VJT or SPIT, then definitely I'll join. You will surely get VJT or SPIT. Yes, Ninety nine point three five three four percent value of it, right? Yeah, yes. Sir. So visit I uh SPIT pakka hai. I mean SPIT to pakka hai. Visit I mean need to understand ki ninety nine point three four ke upper kitne log hai. Huh. Because seats are limited. But sir, which one will be good? As both are you? good. Both are good colleges. Every college, I mean, both colleges have their own advantages and disadvantages. So okay. I have taken one podcast of visit I student and one podcast of the SPIT student. Yeah, uh, I watch both of them. You have watched. Now yeah, I am yeah. planning. I am planning to contact more people of the SPIT and VGTI. If I could connect, I can connect. Then I'll take the more session and we'll post that. So I already have an alumni uh, studying in VGTI from my college only. Okay. He's my senior, one batch. Okay. okay. So, so he he ha he had told me that uh, there are your chances of getting into it, but I'm not just sure. So I'm. Hmm. Just I'm just seeing which opportunity is good for me. If See, both, or... both are the good colleges, undoubtedly. Yeah. Both are good colleges. So I think uh, SPIT the for sure you will get. And thoda the second round, cap round, two tak jaoge, to maybe you get uh, uh, this visit. Yeah, chances are. Hmm. But uh, we don't know how many people are above you. That yeah, is the yes. question mark. Okay. So even the cutoff is not yet. Yet not out, yeah, correct. Yeah. So, wo list out nahi ki unhone, to still, I mean, so far it is difficult to decide. But let's see. Anyways, you are happy with your percentile? <laughs> I'm amazed actually. Uh -huh. Because, sir, I don't know about the percentile because I don't know how it is calculated. Uh -huh. But uh, yeah, after the after I finished my exam, I was like, yeah, 120, 125 plus to aaj actually. Itna to surety tha. But I don't know about like 99% because I have one, once I remember you saying that uh, if you get 149, 150 plus, then only you will get 99%. So, yeah. But, but the toughness sure. of the paper was on the higher side this year, no? Yes, sir. So that, uh, because of that, score-wise, it gone down. Hmm. So, but, yeah. yeah. Preparation was there from starting, but uh, it helped. I first of all, I need to thank you for giving uh, me this opportunity because I never expected but then 99.34 like uh, obviously hitting 99 plus percentile uh, it is a obviously uh, you have worked hard you have prepared well you have practiced you have attended the lecture I used to yeah. see I, I I can remember your face so I because I so don't I never know miss yeah I, I have never missed your lectures uh, because I wanted you personally teaching us Achha. So you can visit a uh, Vasai center most of the time. Most of the time I am available at Vasai center. But yeah, I, I roam around to the center as well. But um, you can contact the team. We can meet not an issue. So uh, matlab, uh, I remember your face when I, I mean I took your counseling and I remember ki aapke ye sare doubt te, I, you, you, you told me this is the placement. Your parents, I think parents bhi aapke se. So, mujhe, I, I don't remember the name of any student. But by face I remember ha, ye bachcha ko dekha hai. So I used to come and take the lecture. Two hours lecture, I mean, eight hours lecture. Half an hour lecture, promotion is done. Yeah. Knowledge of the things. A little bit motivate, karna, charge, give knowledge, etc. So then, okay, good. Okay. So good. Nice to see you. Dadar branch. Uh, relay 3.0 batch you have joined. Weekend batch. Tha. Okay. Yeah. Ninety nine point three four percentile. Nice. Yeah. So yeah. Uh, yeah. 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 Preparation and all. So, academic kya tha, percentage kya the, and how come NCI idea came into the picture? Yeah, starting with the first question. 
Yeah, so uh, basically, I recently graduated from Saint Xavier College, Mumbai. My course was in BSc IT, and uh, my recent this is my first attempt in CAT. As well. And uh, if you like, why MCA? Because uh, I'm I'm much aware of like top MNCs nowadays. They prefer M MCA more than BCA and BSc IT. So uh, yeah, that is a reason I would say if you want to get a good IT uh, role career, you need to get. MCA, but I won't say it's a need, but mm -hmm. it's good to have. So that's what I offer, and then eventually prepare for the entrance. Say okay, since you are from since we are Mumbai Church Gate. Ah, uh, yes. Yeah, specialization? What was your graduation? Mein? The BSc IT. Okay, so obviously, I was not here. Great. And ten twelfth, what was your percentage? Yeah, in tenth, uh, I got ninety point twenty, and uh, HSC eighty seven point eight. Wow. And my current CGPA uh, ACIT is 9.3. Wow. Nice academic background. Thank you, sir. And uh, now, oh yeah. So you now you have given the interview also and you are waiting for your uh call letter, right? Like offer letter, appointment letter. Yeah, sir, because actually I'm not sure about the uh, role, how, how well I'll be suiting with the role. But let's see. What packages you are expecting or they will give you? What do you think? Sir, mostly uh, 3.5 to 4. I, I It's not still uh, disclosed, but it's like I'm, I'm expecting uh, okay. and the pressure. Okay. But if you'll get a VGT SPIT, then obviously you will go ahead, right? Yeah, yeah, definitely. Job to bad, maybe lifetime, PG, right? Yeah, definitely. I have roles be milling, it's a surety. But Carry that letter and everything that will help you in, uh, for, further mm -hmm. when you pass out from the college. No? Yes, you can show, okay, I was getting two years back this. So mm -hmm. I, you have cracked the interview, you have been through the interview, you know, process and all. So that yes. experience will definitely help you. Yes. So, Ellen, tell me about the achha, classroom coaching experience. Batao, matlab, Dada Center pe when you used to visit, I mean, where you stay? Ghat Kopar. Ghat Kopar. So, Dada, you were traveling. Sir, for college, I've traveled the uh, CSU. So, it's not a big deal for me. Haan, so, I want to understand how uh, traveling time is used to use the center. Pe aana, because all the children in the branch of the classroom in other centers, pe bhi hai, they will also understand. Because many people are targeting MCA in 2025. So, yeah. So, like, uh, on Saturdays, basically, I have my college. So, I used to go to college and attend my lectures. And then, from college, I used to come to Dadar. And it's a good Zada waste me at the time. I used to utilize my time as per that. And uh, if I tell about the uh, offline lectures, which was held in Manavre classes, I'll see uh, my 65% to 75% uh, of studies was done in Manavre class itself. And then 25% of my preparation was based on mock test and my self studies. So, majorly, I used to be very attentive in the class. And hmm. like that. So I, I I love like those questions, like important question was solved in the class. Mm -hmm. So it was a big help, I would say. So what do you think? If you if you would have not joined classes or coaching, you could have cracked the exam? Sir, so actually why it's why is the reason of joining the classes? Because I have never appeared for any entrance exam to mm -hmm. Not kind of any like government exams, nothing. This is the first entrance exam. So I I told my dad that I might not have like proper uh proper study guides or anything mentorship. So for the first entrance exam, I definitely need some guides and all that. Or maybe for some other entrance exam also I can have some guidance over it. Oh, okay. Because yeah. So that is the reason I think for the first start I'll definitely take a course. Hmm. It really helped me because other other kind of entrance exam also I came to know because it's like CAT and mm. MBACT and then other government exams. Mm. So like that. So it's not only my MCA preparation from this class, but there are some other way also I got to know. Okay. So uh uh out of four section, quant logic, English and computer, which section was the toughest section for you? So if I break down every section, uh, it will be based on my preparation, not the difficulty level of the paper, I will say. Uh, if I say the most difficult for this exam was maths, 
and the reason behind this is because of my not preparation. It was not like a hundred percent preparation for math because I have my other stuffs also like my college and then my final year projects. So I did not get a sufficient time to prepare for my maths. But I would say like sixty percent of preparation was there. But there are some advanced mathematic uh, maths concepts which was not clear. So many twelfth me kia tha, but revision nahi hua tha. Meko exam se pehle. So that is the reason I would say maths went little tough. But yeah. If I say comms, comm section, um, as I was an IT student, so I didn't prepare much in comms. Because I think basics to tha wo comms mein to mene wo kar liya tha. Just mm -hmm. I need like three to four days of preparation, I did it. Mm -hmm. And English section, yeah, definitely I, uh, you told me like, you know, you told the class you need to read newspapers, RCs, word power mm -hmm. made easy. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. But look. It helped me, but it na mene nahi kiya tha us time. I remember that I used to read the, the Hindu, but not the whole newspaper. It's it's not easy because meko I don't have the habit of reading newspapers, so I only read the editorial part because wow. I feel it's very difficult to interpret those sections. So I used to read that, mm -hmm. and the uh, guides provide kiye the English me. I used to solve those questions and. Uh, Word power made easy. Uh, yeah, I read. It was a fun. Nice. And logic was cakewalk? No, no. Logic, sir, uh, it was good because six, uh, I will say 75% of my learning was in the class okay. for reasoning. And I didn't have self-study in my house for reasoning. I did directly mock test. Hai. So based on mock test, only my practice went good. And so guides me questions, I practiced my practice. Kar. Okay. So, uh, uh, okay. Separately. okay. According to you, what do you think? Being an I'm like I am pursuing my let's say graduation. Along with the graduation, how difficult it is to uh, prepare for the entrance examination? Um, sir, like um, this was not that difficult because ye mera thoda, you know it was from my IT background only, so it's not difficult to do it. It's not difficult to do it. It's something I'm doing very different. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, if I would have prepared for MBA, because I used, I was preparing for MBA CET also, and last night I didn't give it. Uh, I changed my mind. But ha, MBA CET ka ke time, thoda sa, I, it was different. It's okay. not I, I wouldn't say it's not. It depends on your time management skills and it depends on how you Okay. So, MCA ke saasa, koi aur bhi exam likha tha apne? No, no. I, used, like, I was thinking of giving MBA CED, but then I dropped it. Dropped it. Okay. Do you think during your preparation you have done some of the mistakes which one should not do those who are watching this podcast? Uh, so, yeah, because I would say, like, if you're from an IT background, I would say give more uh, give more attention to maths section. Because I think it's not a teen section with not you don't you see if you're good at it, I don't think so. You should give more importance to other three sections. You can solve it, but it's mm. it's relatively easy if you it takes only two to three months of preparation. But for maths, I would say it will take at least a year for a preparation because there are so many concepts in mm. And I would say the uh, uh, definitely give your mock test. Mock test plays a very huge role in any entrance exam because it helped me a lot. So uh, if you solve mock test, at least I would say um, 10 to 15 of mock tests should be definitely be done before the exams. So, be, based on that um, mock test, you can see your weakness and strengths and then. Mm -hmm. So, tell me three learnings from the mock test which you have learned. Okay, so if I see uh, in reasoning section, uh, there were two. There were two concepts like seating arrangements and ranking and ordering. So uh, when I used to solve the mock test, I thought that the whole chapter was 50 50 percent success rate. It's like one of the one mock test I used to get right, and another mock test I should not get right. So I knew that I had to solve it. So I used to solve the uh, section wise, which was the seating arrangement ki question, and I used to reevaluate myself in every mock test. So it's like it's not like one mock test here and then other. One mock test was like your point to understand where you see, where is your preparation level. And second mm. mock test, you do it again, again, and like that. So it was like every mock test gave me a like a learning part. 
is where I have to work hard and where I have to put my preparation going. Okay. You understood your strength, weaknesses, yes. and accordingly you can strategize or further preparation and the mock taking strategy. Yes. What was your order of attempt? Order of attempt is actually I gave my all mock test just I think so 14 days prior to my exam. It was a very less time. Uh, the reason is because I have a lot of college stuff, so I didn't get time to eat not early. But as I was I should give it like morning, then afternoon, evening, I say. Mm-hmm. So, which plan did you have to computer attempt and then logic likewise? Uh, haan, like that, uh, I would say that in mock test ke time, mein I, uh, I should solve first comp section. Computer Kyunki, concept. Because in the comp section, I was strong, so I did the comp section. Karti thi, and I remember in exam also, it took me like uh, within seven minutes, six to seven minutes. It was, I did that. And then English, reasoning, and then English. So I divide the time pehle se hi, preparation ke time, ke itna, itna, a time mein hona and based on that only I did it in the exam. So mera aisa koi question chuta nahi hai and even I did it on that. Nice. And last question, what tips or the session you want to give to upcoming year aspirant? See, every time you were asking to the center, sir, put tips do, strategy do. Now you are giving tips session to the all the viewers. <laughs> <laughs> okay, joke okay, apart. Yeah, go ahead. Okay, so uh, my first important uh, advice to yehi rega because you need to give your mock test. Mock test is important, but I hui hai, nahi hui hai, what level you are in, it doesn't matter, but you should give your mock test. That hmm. is the most important advice. And uh, give more time to math section, they say advanced maths, because Easy level maths they don't ask. So advanced level maths they definitely ask. So they are only all, all your 12th grade level only. But it takes time to revise because it's it's a huge gap after our 12th standards and graduation. And some of them will be more than gap years also. So it depends. So you should be well with maths. Reasoning, English. English also, it depends on how your preparations are. If you're uh, very good in English, it won't take so much time for you. But if not, Definitely, uh, the guides that is provided in the class and uh, the word power made easy, which will definitely help you. But it takes time. One year preparation will take time. But eventually, you will get it. It's not a big deal. And uh, for reasoning, uh, definitely, reasoning is the fun part in all the section, I will say. Because maths will make you bored, but not reasoning. So you can solve mock tests. You can solve the questions. You can, uh, you can solve many questions. There are so many on the internet. It, it depends on how much you practice. Lastly, uh, being in, uh, let's say, English background, English medium background, or we are good in vocal. So we think, okay, what we have to study in English, English, I will do it. But vocal English is altogether different than the solving the English in the exam. Yeah. So if your communication wise, you are good. That is a good news, good part. But you have to read the uh, RC, you have to read the newspaper, you have to work on the grammar, you have to work on the vocab. That you have to do. If you're not doing that part, then it will be difficult to perform well in the English section. Yes, Although you are good in communication wise, that is different sec different part. Yeah. And those who are from vernacular Hindi, Marathi, Gujarati, reading and decoding the question, vocab, grammar, you have to work out without fail. Uh, Eileen, anything else you want to add? I don't know. You can ask me questions. I'm done with the question. Uh, so that's all guys in this podcast uh, lots of things uh, you must be learning from all the podcasts I am taking all these podcasts to give the real feel of the aspirant those who have already cleared the exam with a good percentile so that you can be the next one and you should learn from this podcast implement the same thing in your preparation so that you can perform well in the examination Ellen, once again congratulations for hitting 99 plus percentile and all the very best for your career Thank you so much, sir. You're welcome. Yeah. Bye-bye.